Hey guys, uh, my name is Mark Gill. This is Mark's on the Grill, and we're going to have kind of a fun show tonight. So, uh, hey, listen, do me a favor. If you've been with us before, uh, hello. Nice to see you again. Uh, if you're one of our past winners on a, one of our contests, uh, I hope you're uh, taking a little bit of the, the time that you've got now and using your new stuff and creating some uh, uh, some fun memories while we're all kind of bunkered down and doing our thing here. Um, if you are new to us, uh, what we do is we do a lot of content for different companies online and we uh, we, we create some fun episodes and uh, this is kind of our uh, trial ground here. This is where we uh, practice things and, 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 and edit things down as kind of a sneak peek behind the scenes. So uh, what we're doing today is kind of neat because uh, this week coming up on HSN, by, by the way, has, uh, has this whole coronavirus thing like changed your life at all? Have you changed your routine a little bit? It certainly has with us. Uh, <laughs> and some of them are in pretty good ways, I gotta say. Um, and we've got a big week coming up this week. If you watch our show, then you know that we do a lot of products on uh, HSN. Uh, and we use this as a, uh, you know, like a trying ground for a lot of them. And I practice some of the recipes here for the live on-air shows that we do. Uh, so we're gonna do that tonight with a couple of things that I've never tried before. And I got the idea for this because um, as soon as this uh, uh, coronavirus hit, I turned into like a seven-year-old and bought uh, uh, an Animal Crossing. Anybody's kids <laughs> playing Animal Crossing? Any of you play Animal Crossing? So the way you get things in the game is you get these DIY cards and uh, you get them and you look at them and you're like, oh, now I know how to make that. So I saw a couple of things online uh, today and I was like, oh, let's try that. Let's see if I can be like this guy. Oh, now I know how to make a. Usually you don't after you until you practice it a few times, but today we're going to give it a whirl. Uh, so we got the pan heating up over there. I don't want it to get too hot. Uh, we got our kitchen heat out here. Uh, we're going to do some uh, hash browns uh, with, with some eggs in and some fun stuff. So the first thing we got to do is make some hash browns. Uh, you can grab a cheese grater, but nobody wants to watch me do that for the next five or ten minutes, do they? <laughs> so let's go ahead and fire this bad boy up. So listen, if you're like me and you spent the better part of your adult life trying to figure out why in the world IHOP could make crunchy potatoes, but you couldn't. I'll go over that in a sec. So what you want to do is grab a strainer and a pot or a sink or something, and you want to squeeze these, all right? So let's get them over here. juice we got out of there. That's the secret right there. So, so taters, come on over here. How's this going? Okay, we're getting there. So, here's what we want to do on a nice hot tub. Which one's on? Oh, help That's a brother fine. out here. That one? All right. Cool. Look at these. Hi. Forged in fire pans. That's fun. So, here's what we want to do. Get a little oil in there. These are non-stick, but I want to fry. I want to fry. I want to fry. So let's go get those in there. Now here's what you're gonna do. You're gonna go ahead and start patting these down. Get them right in there, make a nice circle, just like that. Now, how many can we get in there? We got a few more in there? I think so. There we go. Perfect, all right. So turn it down there for me, Trish. So once you do that, now I wanna go ahead around the edges and make it nice. And, ooh, there we go. You can do this with a spoon. So, we've got that going there for just a second. We're gonna leave that. And uh, you know what, well, before we walk right away from that, watch what we're gonna do. Just so that caramelizes up really nicely, let's take a little bit of butter here. Let's just go down the sides. Just like that. There, that's what I wanna do. Let's crisp up. Those side. This is just one of those extra little, you know, uh, little techniques. Is that what you want to call it? Tip trick, whatever it is. Do that. There you go. It takes an extra. What was that? Thirty-five seconds. Uh, let's go over here now. I do have a tip for what I want to do next with these potatoes because I want to flip them over, right? So here's what we're gonna now. Again, no promises, everybody. I haven't done this yet. <laughs> we're we're doing it here, so I don't test it live. So here's a little hand to get these flipped over. Put your plate right there, say a prayer, flip it over. Oh my goodness. Ooh. Look what's happening there and then slide that sucker 
straight back in your pan. I think we did that pretty right. Uh, so now I'm gonna go ahead, and I'm gonna make four, one, two, three, four, little indentations, just like that. Now we do have bacon, right? We, we said this was uh, uh, breakfast for dinner. So let me show you. Great way to do some bacon. I'm gonna move that one over there. And in here, we're gonna dump some butter. These pans heat up so fast too, I love it. That's a cold pan right on there. That's gonna be bubbling in no time. And I'm gonna get some brown sugar. Brown sugar. Nice in there. Get a nice big bubble on with the butter and that brown sugar because now this is when the bacon happens, right? This is like the kind of shortcut to that candied bacon. There's a an hour long recipe out there or you can kind of cut a couple of corners, do it this way and put a nice glaze on it. Is the hash browns that we did. Threw a couple eggs on there. Hi uh, guys, my name is Mark Gill. This is always a lot of fun to hang out with you. Uh, we are just uh, doing our thing back here. We're trying to uh, have a little bit of uh, lighthearted fun uh, uh, in the midst of all the craziness that we're in. So we always, you know, like everybody else tells you, take care of each other, take care of yourselves, all that kind of fun stuff. But please hit that like and subscribe button so you can join us uh, every time we fire up the barbecues here. Sometimes it's just a recipe. Sometimes we got some new products. Uh, sometimes we step on the dog. That happened yesterday. It was tragic. It was terrible.